Hello, in this video I'll show you how to purchase your own domain name with Namecheap.com. Now before we begin, I recommend that you create a free account with Namecheap. So to do that, you just have to click sign up on the left hand corner and then just fill in your username, password, your name, your email address and then when you click create account and continue, they will ask you to fill in your address and phone number. So once you fill that in, you have you would have created your free Namecheap account. Then just go back to the main page. Now, the reason you want to create a free account is because it will make the process of purchasing your domain name a lot smoother and you will get some extra perks like access to Namecheap's coupons and promo codes which I'll show later. Now, I'll show you how to purchase your own domain name. So when you want to get your own domain name, look for the .com extension. The reason is because .com extension is the most available and widely used extension. It's also very useful for search engines like Google and Bing, which makes it perfect for SEO purposes. So when you want to get your domain name, you don't want it to be a really long name. Try to keep it within two to three words maximum. For example, let's take Namecheap itself. It has two words, name and cheap. That makes it easy for anyone to remember and also to type the domain name out. So in the case that you cannot find what you're looking for, you can always use your name as the domain name. For example, it will be like your name.com. You always want it to be .com. Plus .com also is a little cheaper. So for example, I will go with a mix of name and what the website is about. So let's go with DamienPlannings.com. Then you just click enter, you wait. Okay, so here they will show you whether your name that you type is available or not. Here it shows that DamienPlannings.com is available for $8.88 a year. Now this is the usual price for a .com. If you go down under suggested results, you can see there's .net, .dev, .ai, .so, the other extensions, and you can see the price also fluctuates. So, if you are happy with your domain name, you just click Add to Cart and click View Cart. Okay, so you will come to this page. So, here you decide how long you want to register your domain for. You want it to be one year, two years, three years or more. And you can also choose if you want it to renew automatically. Let's say I do not want it. So I just click off. So if once it's off, after a year, they will ask me to if I want to continue. They won't do it on their own. Next, under privacy and uptime protection, you're looking at who is guard. It's a one year subscription. It's enabled automatically and it's free. So it's best to take this. Everything else you can just leave as it is. Now, I did mention about a promo code. So I will show you how to get a promo code. So you just have to go to Google and type name cheap coupon and you put in the month and year you're looking you're currently in. So then you're looking for this option that says promo codes and coupons. So you click on that. And they will come to this page. So Namecheap does offer a monthly coupon. So if I'm doing domain registration, so I just take this coupon code and then I go back to my card and I add in my promo code. Let's see. Okay, it's been successfully applied. So there is a small price card, but it counts. So once you are satisfied with this, you just click confirm order. And then you'll go into payment method. Now, if you have not created your free account, they will instead ask you to make a free account first. Then only you can come to this, to the billing page. So once you're in your payment method, you just fill in your card details. And then you can also choose to pay under PayPal. And then for the receipt, they will use the address that's given in your free account. And you can also choose to do renewals. So once everything is done, you just click continue and you complete the checkout process. 